How's it going, guys? Long time no see. I wish you all a happy new year. Uh, happy 4th of July. Any holidays? Any holidays that you're celebrating? Chinese New Year. I realize it's been a long time. So hopefully you guys have all been celebrating whatever it is that you celebrate. Uh it's it's mid March. This is this is the month. This is the month where uh pros like to make their money. It puts them into good position to uh, be able to purchase things next month, which would be April. Uh, so I mean, here we got some raises, and we'll see what these boys are doing. We're about to find out. See if they want to play or if they don't want to play. And this guy wants to play. I'll play with him. First hand, it's an opportunity to become a chip leader. And I'm going to take that every every chance I get. And we're out. So uh, hopefully you guys had a, had a good time. Hopefully you guys learned something. Uh, see you guys next time. so angry right now. Can't believe I busted out on the first hand. can't even see my own chat Okay, looks like the game has just stepped up to another level. It's time to turn on the observer chat. Observer chat, on. Now I can see. Now I can see what I've been writing.
Oh man, I really was. I, I really am typing with one hand. One hand is on the uh, keyboard. Uh, the other hand is massaging my thigh. Um, today I was doing some work out in the yard. And being the the man of the home, that's just a responsibility I take on. You know, I realize. <laughs> I realize my grandma, she's almost 80 years old. Uh, she can't lift all the logs, you know. If I if she lifts 80%, I lift 20, I I can live with that. I'm still typing with one hand. I'm gonna have defeated. I've defeated this guy in the chat. Um, Carp. Where is Carp? There he is. Let's see what he says. It's all a little bluff here. I'm gonna make him. We're gonna switch the tables. Make him think I'm with my girlfriend. Yeah. Yeah. Jealous, aren't you? Two-handed typing. Oh, he's thinking. He's typing. I can tell. I can tell. Yes, time out and type. Go. Go. Tilt off your stack. Maybe he's too chicken. Advanced maneuver here. Caps lock is on. And we add the ha ha ha. There we go. Checkmate. It's over. I mean, I have years of experience of uh, chatting online. Uh, you guys remember if we go back to the earlier videos, I mean, I'd, I'd chat online with chicks on uh, that were on webcams. I'd do that for a few hours each day. Um, then again, a few hours each night. So, I mean, I got plenty of experience. And you get these uh, cool guys who think they're cool. So I have experience chatting with them as well. (sighs) 
I mean, uh, all chatting aside, this guy looks pretty solid. Um, I will give him that. If I had to bet money, I'd wager that he's going to win this win this tournament here. So I'm going to apologize, but this is a second level maneuver here. Uh, the, this apology is um, I'm on the second level. I'm not on the first level. This is the second level. You guys will see what I mean. Hopefully we can uh, squeeze out some sympathy uh, out of him. Uh, I turn off the caps lock. I apologize. I tell him I'm leaving. Um. <coughs> and it looks like I'm a defeated man at this point. Uh, and we'll see if he, uh, if we can lure him in. Yeah, this is the beauty of busting out on the first hand. Um, you're allowed to sit around on the rail, you know, figuratively speaking. Um, really, I'm just sitting in my room in a t-shirt and some some shorts. Oh, there it is. There it is. There we go. No need to even see what he replies. It's over. We mute him and we win the game. Just like that. Sure, I busted out. I busted out of the tournament. But did I actually lose? Did I lose? I mean, I didn't really lose. I mean, I leave here a winner. Uh, Carp feels like crap. Um, he knows I beat him in his own game. You know, he's playing the game, and I'm playing on a whole different level. Uh, we have a little uh, fighting match here with the chat, and it's a classic move. Um, you know, I the 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 trolls on the internet they taught me well. Um, this wasn't my own genius here, like my poker strategy, all that stuff. I mean, this this is something that I I adopted from other people. Um, and it's the classic move. Pretend you give up. Pretend you want to uh, rebuild those burnt bridges. Well, let's do a little replay here. Caps lock is off. Um, I'm done. I apologize. See ya. He accepts the po apology. And then one last thing. Boom. Headshot. Good game. I'm feeling so good I'm going to play another tournament. Time to, f time to turn off the uh, observer chat. And too many people try to talk to me. I mean, I realize I got a huge fan base. Uh, hundreds of people, thousands, uh, want to speak to me. They want some some knowledge. If they can get 1% of what I know, um, they'd be happy. I want to give them more. I want to give them 2%. But I can't do it while I'm playing games. I can't do that. So hopefully we'll get, get into some strategies. I mean, we, we touched upon uh, some stuff in the last last tournament um, how to play the king jack on the first hand you bust 
usually you get it in you bust um, if you're up against a better hand and you don't suck out so I mean it's kinda like a triple edged sword and you really have to get all three of them to do bad you get the king jack then you have to have another player get a better hand then the other player needs to get it in pre-flop with you then you need to not suck out I mean really the cards are really stacked against you and then only then do you bust so that's why I, I like my chances with the hands 500 who wants to play he wants to play very well let's try to get him to fold cheap now put a little put a little bet on the end there and we're out excellent we got our read it cost us half our stack but we got our read Now this guy's pretty intense. He knows how to play those hands, which is pretty uh, pretty amusing. I figure at these levels, these guys, they don't chase the $500 turns. With the gut shots, he does. He realizes that he's got a lot of outs. He's got the sixes, he's got the fives, he's got the fours, and he's got the backdoor trips. And just in case I, I flop I flop a big one. He's got those outs. I wish he was to my right. It's tough having um, intense opponents to your left. Three, three, three. That's an old trick. Makes it look like you flopped a set. Trips. Three, three, three. And we always followed up with the caps lock. Ha ha ha. There we go. And this is another a little trick. I mean this one I I picked up just um on my own. It it make it may it make it makes uh, it makes people think that you're um, either young, like 15 years old, or an idiot. And now we hit the hand. We hit it now, and we played it aggressively. Oh, oh yes, excellent. Can't wait to see the look on their faces when I when I flip over this beauty. Smiley face, happy. There we go. And there it is. And we're just flopping left and right here. Call. Insta. Insta get it in. Oh boy. Can't wait. Crap. I'm out. Um, hopefully you guys learned something. Oh man.
these guys don't understand that there's a bigger game out there. Observer chat, back on. This is just pwnage right here. He got my chips. I got the breast milk. What do you got to say about that? Nothing. That's what I thought. Check mate game set match one to nothing. Water boat wins. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love myself and I hate you. You suck, and I get all the milk. GG. Philip Knowles. He was a, he's a feisty little critter, isn't he? This is some this is some good banter right here. When I get it when I get up in the morning, I mean I don't even I don't even know that my life is gonna go in this direction, that direction. It's one of the beauties of being rich is that you can you can do everything or you can do nothing. It really doesn't matter because you have a lot of money. Um, add in, you know, I don't really have to do regular things. I got my mom and my grandma. He'll do most of that stuff for me. So this this is just I mean I'm I'm glowing with happiness. I I was busted out first in both tournaments. Oh. Oh crap, is this this is the same bastard? I think it might be. This is a different guy. Um, last tournament, as you all saw, I mean, I was out. Uh, this tournament, I had a good rush of cards, but I was out by the third or fourth hand. Last tournament, same deal. Good rush of cards out first hand.
typical gambler's mindset. You know, you have your you have your sorry people who feel sorry for themselves. You get raped, you feel bad about it. But I'm not a gambler, a somebody who's played the games, who's pushed it to the limit. You know, whether you're a guy like Anders who got AIDS just for the sport or you're like the wolf man who wanted to take hunting to the next level you know who wanted to be amidst the wilderness I mean when you push it to the limit you welcome that pain that comes along with the glory you know as the song goes push it to the limit push it to the limit it's a good song from my youth. Um, if any of you guys ever watched a great movie called... Um, oh, crap. I don't even know what it's called. It's basically a movie where you got uh, Kurt Russell flying around in a jet. And Tom Cruise is like riding around on a motorcycle. And there's like music in the background going, Push it to the limit. Push it to the limit. Anyway, uh, I gotta wrap this video up. Let's see if we can do one last bluff against Philip. Big mistake, my friend. This one's for you guys out there on YouTube. I mean, I show you all the tricks, and I show you how I just... You can be a one-trick pony, and you can just beat these boys at their own games. Whether you're playing poker, whether you're chatting, um, you know, whether you're doing something else. And let's watch. wait for this hand. Oh, nicely done. We'll actually, we'll actually go like this. Boost that confidence in him. Uh, generally, once you uh, write this one last question, you got you gotta put in the uh, the comment before he replies or something because he might get fishy about it. one last question it might sound like I'm trying to jab him so we gotta do a one-two punch um, you can call this a one-two teddy a one-two teddy left left hand is the one the the right hand is the two and the teddy the teddy is the pain that he's about to feel And <laughs> the mute. <laughs> oh. And it's over. That's all she wrote. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, hopefully you guys learned how to talk on the rail, um, how to get victories off the felt. Uh, you know, you lose some... You lose some chips, guess what? You get all that back um, after you're out. So hopefully you guys learned something. See you guys next time.